Dean Gilliland. I'm the conservation director for BASS. And today we're doing the Bass Conservation Cleanup Challenge. And what this is, is a new initiative that we're starting to try to encourage people to leave it better than they found it. Uh, we want to, the whole community to see that we're trying to do things to, to make things better for now and for the future of fishing. And this is one of the ways that we can help get people motivated to start thinking more about conservation and protecting the resources that the sport of fishing depends on. The trash clean up thing, um, it just, it means a lot to me. Uh, I don't like that we would come to a lake. What spurred it on was Gunnersville. It's been so good to me for so many years in the past. Um, fishing and I just absolutely loved the lake and when I got around the bridge and I was fishing and catching these beautiful bass there was trash that just lined the bank and people were standing on it, kids were fishing around it and no one was picking it up. One of the biggest things is education. Um, just you guys here can make a massive difference. Me and my wife Kayla in a matter of four hours picked up ten trash bags, giant big black trash bags in just a couple of hours and on that post when I put it out there and, and showed everyone it got 7,000 um, something likes, thousands of comments of everyone, hey we want to get involved, we want to do this and I was like look at what just me and Kayla did ourselves, imagine what all of us can do here, you tell your friends and we continue it on. Appreciate everyone being here. I think this is going to be something that's going to turn into huge and one day we're going to have hundreds of people here ready to, to, to clean up. This is a great start. Appreciate all the Elite Series guys. It's actually quite fun and at the end of the day it's very rewarding when, when you see what you can do. So let's go and do it.